Welcome to this lesson on subtotals in LibreOffice Calc. Calc's subtotal feature can quickly add subtotals and group data in a table. In this table, I want to group the different regions and get subtotals for each region. To do this, drag and highlight the entire table, then go to the Data menu and choose Subtotals, or use the shortcut. Hold down Alt and press DT. In the Subtotals dialog, Group By drop down, choose Region. In the window where it says Calculate Subtotals for, check Sales. Above the window where it says Use Function, the Sum function is selected. This is the default because most of the time you will want the values added to get a subtotal but you can select any of these other functions to get a count, average, min, max, and so on for the subtotal. Just click on the function. I'm going to leave it on SUM to add the values. Click OK. The subtotals will need formatting. Select the Sales column and press the Currency button. On the left side of the spreadsheet, you'll notice numbered buttons have magically appeared. Below these are buttons with minus signs to indicate that all the data is being displayed. Click the 1 button to display only the grand total. Click the 2 button to display only regional totals. The row with the subtotals display the region, then the function it used for the total, sum in this case. The buttons below the 2 are now displaying plus signs. Click any one of them to display the detail for that region. When you click the 3 button, you get all the data in the table, all subtotaled and grouped. You can have up to three groups of subtotals. For example, if you wanted to further group this table by customer so that it displays subtotals for both region and customer, drag and highlight the complete table again. We need to get the subtotals dialog back. You could go to the data menu, but I'll use the shortcut keys. Hold down Alt and press DT. Click the tab at the top of the dialog that says Second Group. In the Group By drop-down, choose Customer this time. In the window where it says Calculate Subtotals for, check Sales, click OK. The sales column will need formatting again. Select it and press the currency button. On the left side there are now four buttons to display subtotals for the different levels. One displays the grand total, two displays the regional totals like before, three will now display both the regional and customer subtotals, and four displays everything. Click the minus signs to hide the detail for any group, and click the plus signs to display it again. Now to remove the subtotals from the table, first make sure the table is showing all the details by clicking the FOR button. Drag and highlight the entire table again. Hold down ALT, press DT to get the subtotal dialog back. Then click the Remove button at the bottom. After the subtotals are removed, the table will still be sorted by region and customer. If you need it back to its original form, you could press Ctrl Z repeatedly until it's back the way it was. Well, that concludes this lesson on using LibreOffice Calc subtotals. Thanks for watching!